Geonodes are powerful, so let's make a squiggly outline with them. Select the object and create a new node group. At the set position, plug a normal node into the offset. Adjust the scale of it with a vector math node set to scale. And you are good to go. Join the base geometry with the outline. And basically, you just made your own solidify modifier. Add the flip faces node here. Now, set the outline's material. But make sure back face culling is enabled on that one. That's important. And ta-da! You have your outline. Let's make the outline squiggly. That means the scale should be uneven, so plug a noise texture to it. It looks awful, but if you add the map range node and tweak it a bit along with the noise texture, you can get some nice results. If you want to animate it, add the position node and the vector math node set to add. This moves the texture in 3D space. Yes, you can switch to 4D and animate the seed as well, but it requires more computational power. Add the scene time node and plug the frame into the vector. When I hit play, this moves the texture on every frame. But I want to move it on every 4 frames. Add the math node, set it to divide and type 4 here. It doesn't work because I need to add another math node set to snap and the value is 1. It snaps the values to every whole number. So this setup changes the noise on every 4 frames. But if I type 10, then it will change on every 10th frames. Adjust the noise and the map range values till you are happy with it. The project file is available on Patreon. For more outline techniques, check out this video.